Uh, and the, the real challenge historically is that we, we tend to measure what's easy. You know, Andrew and I just you know, talked about this earlier in the webinar. Uh, and, and it's mostly about consumption and not what matters. They're not the, the numbers that the business really cares about. Am I making sales uh, processes faster? Do projects complete more successfully on average? Uh, are our customer support process is directly increasing our MPS score, net promoter score with customers, which is a common uh, customer satisfaction metric. Uh, no, we, we tend to look at how many active users we have, how many page views, uh, how many searches were conducted, because it's easy. That's the data we have until now. Things like digital adoption platforms like to look cross application and see what workers are really doing where they're challenged, where the things are taking too long or where they're abandoning the process altogether and then going and addressing that right? and not letting that data go open loop. So it, for me, it's a very exciting time. We've always wanted to do this. We just couldn't do it before. Uh, and so what are the metrics that matter? Um, the most important thing, and I, 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 I work with a lot of digital workplace teams and I have for, for most of my career. And most of them come out of IT. They don't necessarily understand that if you ask, let's say, for a budget for a digital adoption platform and you don't go back and you know, show them how you improve the business, if you go back with page views and number of logins and number of active users, you're going to say, that's great, but what is it? I don't know what that means to my business. Uh, have you helped it? Uh, and so the metrics that, that really matter are, are the things that, that matter to the business. So just be aware of that. Are you increasing sales? Are you helping customers?